Hi everybody, it's Amy. And in the comments of my last video, I said I would do a, ham um, a hamster care series. So, I see. <laughs> Sorry guys, I see a bit thing. Ice cream. So if he actually gets out the ball. Um, but this first video is just going to be about me ice cream. And I'm going to tell you the story of how I got him. So, yeah. He's going to come out the ball eventually. So basically, when Ice Cream was in the pet shop, he was really, like, shy. Um, and then, come out the ball. But then, um, he, like, then I remember we went to the counter because, like, there was a big box and then another little box and he was inside the little box. And when we got to the counter, he bit through both of the boxes. So we had to have another two boxes. And I remember I was screaming in the car because like he bit through them boxes as well. And then all I could see was his little mouth poking out the like holes. Um, so yeah, that was scary. But then we left him in his cage for a couple of days because that's what you're meant to do. And then like loads of people do like bathtub bonding and stuff but um i didn't um i sat in my playpen with him and he got tame really quickly he's only bit me once as well that's when i tried to wake him up like you know when he was sleeping so yeah that's good and um yeah i think that's it and then we just started getting good friends and oh, running the marathon running running do you want to go in your ball for a bit i see <sighs> sorry guys but then um like when all my friends came around like we kept on feeding him a lot of like milk drops if you don't know what they are like i don't think i have any milk drops left yeah but um um yeah so i um but like my friends and me kept on feeding him loads of milk drops and then he started getting really fat so now my new year's my new year's res my new year's res my new year's resolution is to like make um is to like get him in the ball for a few times like and i'm going to be doing loads of hamster care series videos like like good and bad hamster foods and i'm gonna show you all of icy stuff like and just advice if you're getting a hamster or anything because i'm gonna get icy back icy come on come to the camera I see. Get off the camera. But yeah, it was. Um, I watched um Chocolate Colors Twenty Six do this, so please don't say I'm copying off her. But and she gave me advice when I was gonna get a hamster, and in fact, I was gonna name ice cream Wasabi because that's her hamster name, and I thought it was so cool. Um, but then because it was a white hamster, I didn't really want to call it Wasabi, so I named him Ice Cream. <laughs> I see, don't go under the bed. Oh my gosh. Gonna have a hard time getting uh, getting him out of there. But um anyway. And also I have another story to tell you. Um how long has it been? Three minutes. Okay, I'll tell you this. Um see I see was in his cage. It's up there if you don't know. And like he was chewing the bars. And one hour slept over mine. Um Oh my gosh, I see. Um, sorry, I'm getting really uh, confused and stuff. But when Ella sat over mine... Who cares about I see? Just, when Ella sat over mine, then he started, like, climbing up and then chewing the, like, door where you open it. And then I got really scared and I thought he was going to escape. So we put, made, like, a, a very big cushion mounting, like, underneath, like, the cage where he would fall. Like... But then, <clears throat> I don't know if it was the next day, but it was one of the days after she slept over. Um, then I see actually escaped out of that because he was chewing it so hard that he opened the cage. Um, 
So then he escaped and he went downstairs and my mum and dad were awake in like the middle of the night when I was still asleep and then I like woke up and then I was trying to find him and then we left food out because that was Traffic Colors 26's thing so thank you. Um, but we left loads of food out and um, we left loads of food out and um, like we left it downstairs and upstairs and we put like the cage on the floor. But um, the next day I woke up and then like I, I looked in every single room, including our playroom, which is now a study. But it was the playroom at the time, was it? I don't know. I'm just going to say playroom. And then um, like no food was there. And then like me and my dad were trying to like find where did we put the food? Did we put food in it? So I put some more food out and then I went upstairs to get dressed. Then I came down and then the food was gone, so I was like, hmm, and then, so I went to go and get my shoes on, and then I had one last check, because I really wanted to find him before school, so I, so, like, I, um, looked, and then I stepped, and then I heard scratching, and I, um, and then, like, I just, I heard scratching, first of all, I thought it was my shoe, so I stopped, and then I heard even more scratching. So I went upstairs to tell my dad. Then we both ran downstairs. And then we heard the scratching even more. And my like the car my carpet at the time was like rolled up. And so we opened the carpet and there was Icy going like that. And it was so funny. But then he ran away from us and went under the arena. And yeah. But we did get him back. So that was good. And there was one time, it was the first, I'm, I'm saying loads of stories here, but like, it's just for you to know Icy better. And there was one time where um, I took Icy um, like into my mum's room because like I was, I was really trusting him. And then I took him into my mum's room and then he started like, I don't know what he did. He did like a crazy mad, like, let me out. So then he fell down. My mum's unit, and then like I was crying, and then so my mum told me to go and calm down in my bed, otherwise he won't like come out. And he was actually running like under my mum's bed. It was so funny, but like you know, scary at the same time. I see. What are you doing? But yeah, it was so funny, but so scary at the same time. Like I can't. And then like we finally got him back, and. Yeah, but if you don't know, we have a cable tie and a padlock on the door. Well, you can't really see, but I'll show you now. Nope. Oh, guys, I'm sorry. It's very bad. Very bad thing. Um, can't really show you. I see, and it's like this, but there's a cable tie. And a padlock on here, so yeah. Um, this video was kind of like all over the place, but hopefully, like you liked it. And um, please leave in the comments what video I should do next on my hamster care series. Um, yeah, and. I'm leaving I see him for because he's quite fat. And there was the time when my mum called him fattish rattish and fat rat. So yeah. Um oh, I said this so many times, but please leave a comment on what you want me to do on my next hamster Kiss series video. And I think I'm gonna do like um showing you all of Icy stuff and like um just advice and like what you should do to keep your hamster healthy and is icy coming back for the end of the video he's run away from me but anyway that's the end of this video hopefully you all enjoyed and i'll see you on the next one bye